the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes looking to continue his dominance in WWE. Competing at his highest level, striving for the main event and the biggest prize. You just have to be impressed with the form that Cody Rhodes has taken. He's become a leader, a mentor, and a main eventer. Those are all great things to be, Saxton, but we all know what Cody truly wants to be more than anything else is a world champion. The following contest is in elimination match. Introducing first from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins. And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do. And that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. can share the ring with Rollins at Mania. Jey Uso is here and he is a new man. From San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, main event, Jay Uso. Main event, Jay Uso is at the showcase of the Immortals. All right, he made good on his moniker by taking part in the first tag team title match to ever main event WrestleMania. stars in WWE, but his following grows every single night. And Jay looks ready to deliver on his unbelievable hype.
It is indeed time to play the game. Triple H, a true mastermind, dismantles opponents piece by piece. You're right about that, Cole. Each and every move is perfectly calculated. Representing the authority from British Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, the game, Triple H. Only three men with double-digit WrestleMania wins, Undertaker, Cena, and this man. Triple H has defeated Booker T, Randy Orton, and Batista. At WrestleMania. Yeah, get this. Second only to Hulk Hogan in main event show closing WrestleMania matches. Because on this stage is where Triple H is his most cerebral, his most brutal at the showcase of Immortals. This is a man who has truly mastered every aspect of this business. Yeah, a true genius behind the curtain, almost as much as in the ring. Speaks to his love for this industry, his love of competition. Uh, you mean his love of dominating the competition. The bloodline has arrived. Their dominance is historic. And at a combined weight of 766 pounds, Roman Reigns, Solo Sokoa, and Jimmy Uso, the bloodline. WrestleMania, acknowledge them. Maybe the most dominant faction ever in sports entertainment. You might say WrestleMania is the only stage worthy of the bloodline. When it comes to the bloodline, the showcase of the Immortals is family business. Rikishi, the father of Solo and the Usos, has many WrestleMania matches under his belt. And Roman Reigns' father competed back at WrestleMania 4. The bloodline has expanded that legacy, grown on that history. And they intend to add to it tonight by doing what they do best, win.
The American Nightmare is here. The son of a son of a plumber looking to continue the Rhodes legacy. Cody Rhodes has been on a mission as of late to solidify his position at the top of the WWE. He reached the main event of WrestleMania. He conquered Brock Lesnar. Now it's time to finally finish the story. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins. And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do. And that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. has crushed internet sensations and crushed uh, energy drink bottles. Don't forget about facing this WrestleMania nightmare in the form of Cody Rhodes. Nobody does mania like Rollins. Only the biggest names, the toughest opponents can share the ring with Rollins at mania. Excuse me. Well, guys, there's only one question left. Do you smell what the rock? Saxton, know your role and never say that again. Rock soaking up the adulation of the people one last time before the bell rings.
Here comes our tribal chief. Perhaps the most dominant champion in WWE history. The head of the table, Roman Reigns. Presenting the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! WrestleMania, acknowledge him! Plenty of WrestleMania history for the Tribal Chief, defeating legends like Triple H and The Undertaker. But since taking his spot at the head of the table, he has successfully defended the same championship at three consecutive WrestleManias, defeating the likes of Brock Lesnar and Cody Rhodes. champion, an unbeatable competitor. That's why every time Roman competes, it is a history-making moment. Here we go with the tag matchup the WWE Universe has been salivating for. We are set for action and starting things off with Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. Now they will be facing some fierce tag team action with The Rock and Roman Reigns. And trust is key to victory in a match like this. If you don't have a tag partner you can rely on, you might as well pack it in now. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Double shake back body drop. Putting up a united front as this match continues. And he's 
able to reverse. These two trade encounters, an absolute masterclass. To the arm. Partner tags in. to the dome. That'll leave you seeing double for weeks. Oh, able to counter. Oh, what a shot. Talks about just bringing it, judging by that attack. Rock knows the fight has come to him. Oh my gosh! I don't stop anybody. Seth Rollins with the tag. Looks like The Rock is feeling it. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Tucks his tail between his legs and gets out of there. Ripcord. Oh my goodness, nasty line. Look at this, just unloading. Nasty stop to finish it off. Gentlemen, in the interest of self-preservation, I may have to excuse myself. Saxton, you hang tight. Let this play out. Got him where he wants him. Up and vintage Falcon Arrow. Oh, driving the elbow. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. The Rock saw that one coming. Uh, tag made. Oh, right to the gut. Man, oh man. Tandem offense in effect. A good team knows how to truly work as one. Clean tag for his partner. to the gut and a big right hand
and a tag there. Big time clothesline. Good grief. And a clothesline. Now watch the precision with this. What a blow. Carefully, will this be enough? Two. He's far from finished. Roman Reigns makes the tag. Tossed into the corner. Nicely done. Able to reverse. There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, an overhand punch. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. Trying to fight with a hurt arm is no easy task. Tag That's made, tag. fresh man in. Place boot ends that. Compromised position here. Flinged across the way. Oh my goodness. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Pinpointing the leg. In the corner. He's absorbed some damage already. Rollins unleashes athleticism there. Impressive reversal on Rollins. In the counter from Rollins. Fired up now. Tough position to be caught in here. Outright presentation of power 
there. Oh my goodness. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. And tagged in as The Rock. And proving a bit slippery for them there. Headlock applying a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. flight and soaring through the sky. One. Got him where he wants him. Up and Falcon Arrow. He may be in a bad Two. way here. Yeah, they've stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Guys, they're getting way too close for comfort here. Yeah, I've seen this before and it doesn't end well. <laughs> Big time clothesline. Good grief. Rhodes letting his opponent know who's in charge. Six. Whoa! Suicide dive! It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Oh, he retaliates! He is delivering elbow after elbow. Inverted atomic drop. Ooh. Action needs to return to the ring and fast. And he tosses him back in now. Cody Rhodes hooks him up. Rush Rhodes. Cody Rhodes just might have finished things. the save for his team. It's been an elacious encounter thus far. The tides have swung in multiple directions. It's anyone's guess how this one's going to end. Yeah. Yeah. A striking blow. And he closes it out. He breaks the ref's count before two. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Boom! Hoist it up. Will it be? I think 
Lasso! No, he gets the shoulder out. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. This match has been history in the making. This is insane! There's a tag. There's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Got him where he wants him. Up and to the Falcon Arrow. The close of this match is just ahead. And this is, uh, well, it's not looking good. Headed to the top rope. Incoming. Five star frog splash for the win. Two breaks the close count. I am shaking my head in disbelief over how he managed to get the shoulder up. Uh-oh, it's gonna, we're gonna see it! Stop! We've seen this win matches for Rollins. Makes a cover! Tonight. What a battle Rollins has waged so far, but he's not finished yet. Drop kick to the face. Seth Rollins. surprised that what we're witnessing is trending. Forget trending on social media. The motion in the arena is charting on the Richter scale. Tag 
bringing his partner in now. so desperately need right now. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. Six. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up.
The shot caller is in the house. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 251 pounds, Jimmy. We've seen many sides of Jimmy Uso throughout the years, but he has never been more dangerous. Jimmy Uso now with a killer instinct we've never seen before. But you have to wonder if Jimmy is perhaps facing more adversity than ever. He's had documented issues with his brother, with his family. He might be a man without a bloodline at this point. Jey Uso is here, and he is a new man. And his opponent from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, man. Main event, Jey Uso is at the Showcase of the Immortals. All right, he made good on his moniker by taking part in the first tag team title match to ever main event WrestleMania. Already one of the most popular stars in WWE, but his following grows every single night. And Jay looks ready to deliver on his unbelievable hype. Extreme Rules match is underway. The kind of match that can make or break careers. It's certainly a moment of truth for many superstars. An opportunity to display one's toughness and barbaric side. Piercing the throat. Oh. Oh. From the ground up. Up high and... Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Counters, this could be an opportunity. Mounted with punches and not. Oh man, Jay's face telling a painful story now. Just breaking down the opponent. Trapped in the corner. No escape from these punches. He catches Jimmy with a counter.
Uh oh. Gets him with the counter. Close line. Oh, that'll leave a mark. I'd have to think that a no disqualification match favors the most heartless competitor in the ring. Well, that's mostly true, but even the most rule-abiding superstars have risen to the occasion of a no-disqualification match. When there are no rules, there's no wrong and right. And we know when he has a chair in hand, things get messy in a hurry. Catches the kick. Close by takes him down. Forget about it. Playing possum! Shoulders down! Jimmy Uso with an easy kick out. Still a ways to go in this match based on that. What a clothesline! Ouch. And it's Jay being on the receiving end of some fury there. Yeah, as that ruthless side of Jimmy just absolutely took over there. Oh, what a super kick! A double super kick! Goes into the pin. Two! Oh, he kicked out. Somehow, some way. Front face lock applied. It's about to get more painful. Top suplex. This could be big. Going up high. Up high. Cross body. Off into the pin. The refs count. I didn't think this match was close to over. Put in a position now. Right across the legs. Oh, this, this superstar using the rope as a weapon. This is uncalled for. If a shortcut presents itself, you better take it. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the low road. And he is daring his opponent to face him with the steel chair. Gets inside the ring. to counter. Ooh, clothesline deliver. What a headbutt. Vicious. How's that for a counter? Oh, kick right to the gut. Kick. He's struggling a bit here. That's just the kind of thing main event Jey Uso does, gentlemen. He's about to become the chairman. Jimmy gets intercepted. back. Jay with an opening to go high. From the top. What? What a reckless attack. Off the top rope, putting it all on the line. Kick to the gut. 
Cranked around into a neck breaker. Smothering offense now from Jay Uso. Jimmy here in a disheartening position. Breaker. Don't come over here! Cole, quick! Use Saxton as a human shield! Weapon in hand saying, I'm up in the ante. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Jimmy Uso is showing signs that it could be ending soon. Yeah, Jimmy's got to figure something quick. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Jimmy Uso is going to need to get his comeback on lockdown. Good call. Completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap. Very effective. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Oh, my goodness. Kick to the spine. Looking for a schoolboy. Uh oh. He's taking this to the floor now. Oh, man, come on now. Not a sledgehammer. Ooh, sledgehammer to the body. This is cover here. Kicks out. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. to every attack. This is Uso's perseverance getting tested. Outside the ring now, he has no need to rush. And plenty of damage continues to mount on Jay. 
Jimmy is displaying how far his stamina can be tested. Blow for blow, it's like Jimmy and Jay are wrestling their own shadows. We might never find competitors this well matched again. Up they go! That'll jam your tailbone. Oh, what a super kick, a double super kick. Cold-blooded Jimmy Uso in full effect there. Doing what he needs to do once again. A quick response to Jay's offense. Jay is down and out. Everyone is out of their seats right now. All eyes are glued on the action in front of them. And gets tossed back into the mat. Looking to do a little clanging and banging with that sledgehammer. Oh, using that hammer like this was a trick. He's going for the pin. This could be. in a second to stay alive there. He's in his clutches. Fires back with a crucial elbow. Jay managing to find some of that needed breathing room. Time now to get his energy up and bam! Will Jay take advantage? Is it enough? The cover! There's two! What? Only two? Man, oh man, what resilience. He's got to be running on instinct alone. And Jay threw everything he had at his opponent. You got to wonder what else he's got to do to put him away. A deafening cheer from the WWE Universe is reverberating around us. Absolutely unreal. These two having an answer for everything. Oh, man, what a headbutt. And here he comes. This changes the game right here. You can say that again, Cole. Not only change it, it might end the game. He got whipped into that corner. Caught him right in the jaw. Whoa, what a shot. Oh, oh, Left an opening and got a kick to the face. Neckbreaker. He is obviously taking way too much pleasure in this right now. Oh, man. Adding more injury to injury with that hammer. For the pin and the win. Yes. He kicks out at two. Thought he had it. you got to be kidding me. Clutches. Simone drop. Kick 
to the body. Caving in the abdomen. And he's taking this to the outside now. He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the fray. He'll head to the ring. God, disturbing impact. He may get the three count right here. This is it. No, a two count. How? How? Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Jey Uso got something in mind. What's it going to be? Oh, uh, look backing Ooh. things up. Shades of his daddy. Oh, hip attack. Jey Uso is just going wild. He's giving Jimmy everything he's got and then some. All eyes focused on this absolute roar. It doesn't get more masterful than this. Clothesline takes him down. Forget about it. Jay puts a stop to that. Bad predicament right here. Just launched. Down on the ground, getting pummeled by that hammer. Jimmy Uso getting worked on right now. Yeah, Jimmy keeps getting cut down at every move. Jimmy saves himself. That was vicious. Does Jimmy have any fight left? Cover. Two count. And finally, finally, he picks up the victory. Here is your winner. talking about yeah despite the earlier distraction they were able to focus and keep their eyes on the prize see the distraction didn't even phase them in the long run Corey they won in spite of it I don't know I think it gave them the motivation they needed to win this one for someone who loves the sound of his own voice do you ever hear yourself Here comes the prize fighter. A man who always looks ready for a fight. 
The following contest is a three-on-two tag team handicap match. Introducing first, from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. Guys, it is once again time for KO Mania. And normally naming yourself after the showcase of the Immortals would be bad luck, but Owens has no shortage of WrestleMania moments. Jumped off the WrestleMania sign against Seth Rollins, beat Sami Zayn, gave Logan Paul a stutter. But in perhaps the greatest KO Mania moment, he brought the Rattlesnake out of retirement in the main event of WrestleMania 38. The Apex Predator has arrived. One of the all-time greats has seen and done everything there is to do in this and business. From St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton. You know, Randy Orton watched his father in the very first WrestleMania main event, and then he went on to main event multiple WrestleManias of his own. Now this is a stage where he's faced the likes of The Undertaker, Triple H, and John Cena. We have seen Randy Orton go from being known as a legend killer to a legend. And we know Orton only needs three letters to create the ultimate WrestleMania moment. R-K-O. Randy Orton is as lethal as they come. And that's what makes Orton so intimidating. Every opponent knows what the Viper is capable of, and it's scary. It's got to be hard for any competitor to stay composed, knowing that they could be Orton's next victim. Here comes the double champion. From Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, he is one half of the undisputed WWE Tag Team Champions, Austin Theory. Just think about the grind that comes with being a double champion. As great as the glory is, the hard work that comes with it is no joke. Yeah, he may look good showing off the gold, but he's got to look good defending it as well. Otherwise, it'll be gone. He's here and holding two championships. And from Sydney, Australia, weighing in at 206 pounds, he is one half of the undisputed WWE Tag Team Champions, Grayson Waller. Holding two titles is the ultimate statement of power. Who could question him at this point? Let there be no doubt this is what domination looks like. And he's at the top of this division. He's 
looking pretty unshakable entering the ring. Yeah, and whether he is or not, just appearing that way to your challenger is what it takes. And the champion knows that. Gentlemen, stand up and cheer this social media icon. And from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 205 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, Logan Paul. He's just as flashy as ever. He belongs on the WrestleMania stage. Logan Paul certainly loves soaking up the spotlight. Knows how to make a WrestleMania caliber entrance. Remember when he rode a zip line to the ring? <laughs> well, WrestleMania is all about turning things up, and Logan's great at that. Could be another great WrestleMania performance from Paul. I, I have a question for you guys. How many folks can say they made their WWE debut across the ring from Ray? You're right, Corey. Uh, Logan Paul accomplished something that few ever have. And Rey Mysterio was the one who felt the honor. Oh. Tough spot for this team as they face off against three superstars. Normally, I'd bet on the side with the numbers game, but if this duo can utilize great teamwork, I think they might just have what it takes to win. up like this, Byron, talk about the importance of keeping the fresh competitor in the ring. Oh, it's crucial. Super kick by Theory. Ataxia. Is that what it takes to beat KO? Cover! Two count! He stays alive! He stays alive! I honestly have no idea what is driving Owens right now. And I'm not even sure he does either. Owens is tough as they come, but also as stubborn as they come. A dangerous combination. And Theory clearly thought he had it there. He might have to consider a new strategy at this point. Austin Theory about to take his opponent. Oh, the Can Theory close this? Is it enough? The cover! There's two! Amazing! Kevin Owens perhaps showing more fight than sense, but he clearly is still in this one. All the same. And Theory clearly thought he had it there. He might have to consider a new strategy at this point. Can't quite get him there. Close right, right takes him down. Forget about it. showing that they have each other's number. Ouch. And now look at Austin's face after that. Oh. lost some of his win now. That's KO backing up his words with actions. With the tag is Randy Orton.
Oh no, I know what Randy's thinking. This won't end well. Business here is all but over. Cannot believe what we are seeing out of him tonight. Believe it, Saxton. And this match is still not over. Orton is seething at that kick out. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. What a punch. Crisscross action. And Shoulder up now is huge. Randy with a counter. Reconstruction. That's not very nice. Ripping and tearing at the face. Oh, meet the backside of an elbow. You can't take much more of this. He can really stand to give back as good as he's getting right about now. And tag. He did it. Let's go. Horn with a fence press. And now here come the punches. Hooked up. DDT. The Viper showing off his power.
These men have been giving each other such a beating. And you can see the toll of that beating taking effect with every movement. DDT! the tag Hall avoids the attack and set right into the corner oh, we're going to grind the features off their face What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Logan Paul is showing no fear up there. Perched up top. Blockbuster connects. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. Over the top rope.
at this point in a handicap match, you have to expect some lasting damage. Considering the situation, things could be far worse. And shot from Logan, but we know he won't stop until he lands it. From way up high! Yeah. We are seeing a ridiculous amount of risky moves. We'll see if it pays off. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match and is for the Undisputed 
WWE Universal Championship. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes, looking to continue his dominance in WWE. Competing at his highest level, striving for the main event, and the biggest prize. You just have to be impressed with the form that Cody Rhodes has taken. He's become a leader, a mentor, and a main eventer. Those are all great things to be, Saxton, but we all know what Cody truly wants to be more than anything else is a world champion. From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins. And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do, and that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. The bloodline is here. The WWE Universe is in awe. All the power, all the attention. Every move they make makes headlines. And every move they make continues their dominance. WrestleMania, acknowledge them. Maybe the most dominant faction ever in sports entertainment. You might say WrestleMania is the only stage worthy of the bloodline. When it comes to the bloodline, the showcase of the Immortals is family business. Rikishi, the father of Solo and the Usos, has many WrestleMania matches under his belt. And Roman Reigns' father competed back at WrestleMania 4. The Bloodline has expanded that legacy, grown on that history, and they intend to add to it tonight by doing what they do best, win.
bloodline has survived rare losses, defections, yet still remains strong. Yeah, tonight is a showcase of the bloodline's strength. Introducing the challenger from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rose. And his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed. WWE Universal Champion Roman Reigns. Serious faces on our competitors. This big moment is not lost on them. There it is. The ultimate prize. The Universal Championship. A title worth putting it all on the line for. The most prestigious prize in WWE's men's division. The undisputed Universal Championship and the balance here tonight. There is no bigger prize in our business than that piece of hardware. Just taking a look at its past holders reads like the WWE Hall of Fame. Yeah, Corey. And almost any time it's on the line, we see a Hall of Fame match. The champ probably hoping that emphatic attacks like that will keep them in control here. Oh, kick right to the back. Nap time on the island of relevancy. I'm not. He needs to find an escape route. Nice. Uh, Side Russian leg sweep. He's got the answer for that one. out and he has all the time he wants he's got a sledgehammer and you better believe his opponent's name is all over it he is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad don't say that too loud saxon you might get caught and each of these lethal maneuvers have got to be taken at figure four leg lock applied trying to find a way out the pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Is there something to focus on when preparing for this career-altering match? You've got to accept the fact that you're going to be punished like you've never been punished before. And no mercy will be given. In this situation, you can completely unload on your opponent and a referee's count can't stop you. You can set the rule book ablaze. Oh, yeah! <clears throat> Elbow throw saying not today. The champ is used to flying first class, and that wasn't it. 
Moves outside. What's the plan here? Good God, what force. The hammer dropped. Literally, something might be broken. Just bashing them with that hammer. We are witnessing a malicious string of attacks right now. So many dangerous attacks, one after the other, making it difficult to regain any composure. What's it going to take? He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. Oh, what a boot. He's looking for some sort of respite, unable to get out of the ring. He doesn't want to be hung up in the bottom rope like that. He is looking to do some serious harm. Drive by! Roman dealing with Cody as he has so many others with disdain. He steps foot in the ring again. Just mounted with punches and not... To the gut, too. I don't know if this is a good idea. This is going to take more strength than he has left. A lift up. Pressure being put on Rhodes. Reigns isn't giving Cody any breathing room. Kick to the cut. Uh-oh. Cody retaliates. And that might be the start of the momentum swing Cody needed. Cody Rhodes tipping the scales a bit here. Suplex, no! Driven down! The big dog is unleashed! Reigns is making an opportunity for himself. Burying knees into the body. The challenger being outclassed here. Holding on by a thread, maybe even less at this point. Ooh, stinging kick. Setting up. Suplex. This heel hook. 
This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. So much torque on the knee and ankle. to a monkey flip. Those last hits rattled the champ. In order to succeed in an extreme rules match, you have to be willing to sacrifice your body a bit, guys. for this next stretch. Uh. Oh no, crashing hard onto the floor. Face, meat floor. I think I see a few teeth on the floor. No clue what he hopes to find down there. And as a couple of Hall of Famers once said, it's time to get the tables. And he goes into the ring. Down with a suplex. A continuous assault. Elbows on the mark. Oh. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right in the face. My God. That's how you wear down your opponent. in this one. Oh, man. Obviously hoping to take things to the next level with this ladder. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Oh, speed with the ladder. Well, this is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. Is he thinking of a submission here? Remarkable power being shown here. It, oh, man, that was a thing of beauty. Right into a snapmare. Oh, that was just malicious. Oh, man. Insulting. Ah, uh, face 
first off the post. I don't know if this is a good idea. This is going to take more strength than he has left. A lift up. Power bomb. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Oh, and a reversal. Rose timed that one. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Cody Rose has his opponent right where he wants him. Looking to put his opponent on Dream Street. Crossroads. Gonna see a new champ. Two. Oh, kick out, kick out of two. What a display of stamina. The champ showing they're truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. Disbelief on the face of the American nightmare. What's he gonna have to do to put this away? Absolute barn burner. Oof. Oof. Drop kick all the way to the floor. Cody looking to attack from above. From the top. Through the air. And connects. Soaring through the sky and crashing onto their opponent. Shot to the face. Both arms hooked. A pedigree. I still think Rhodes is going to need more to topple Roman. Perhaps looking for some kind of equalizer here. Oh boy, come on, not the chair. Ooh. Ooh. He's feeling it, got him in his sights. <laughs> Saw it coming. Textbook jumping clothesline. Ooh. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Back on the champion. Can the champion respond with their back again? 
against the wall. I don't believe it. Reigns has ended so many matches that way, but this one just took an unexpected turn. We're at a vital stage in this matchup, and this audience is fully aware of it. Yeah, they know another turning point can come at any second, and that can be the instant that ends it all. Close line! Good so lord! So effective! Taking this outside. This could be good. has led him into this very dangerous situation. Yeah, bit by bit, he was broken down. Now he's practically a sitting duck. He climbs into the ring. Level move for the win. Two count. He's still in this fight. That's how much winning this title means to give everything you've got. I don't know how much you can have left after that, but you've got to be impressed. Reigns now realizing that he's facing an even tougher level of opponent than usual tonight. Taking flight. Crash landing. Seeing something special from the champ here. The head of the table cinches it in. Now the guillotine choke is taking out so many superstars. Oh my god. And the champ retains. his title reign with a gutsy performance.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Women's World Championship. Look out, here comes the history maker, the man, Becky Lynch. I'll tell you what, you cannot understate what Lynch has meant to sports entertainment and to women everywhere. <laughs> Becky Lynch went from the pre-show at WrestleMania 34 to winning the main event of WrestleMania a year later. Won both the Raw and SmackDown Women's Championship that night on the grandest stage. Becky Lynch, a woman who's done it all, yet continually improves herself with every match. And that means that every time the man competes, we are seeing her at her best. Ladies and gentlemen, mommy's home. Here comes Rhea Ripley. At WrestleMania, Rhea Ripley's brutality goes to another level. The Nightmare is an even more ferocious competitor at the Showcase of the Immortals. And how about her vindicating win at WrestleMania 39, where she finally earned a victory against Charlotte Flair? A moment that many thought was the night's true main event. Certainly was a main event level victory for Ripley, cementing herself as a WrestleMania threat. Oh, what a tall task for this woman here tonight, trying to prove she's worthy. Much easier said than done, Cole. We know Becky Lynch is always at the top of her game.
This is what these competitors have worked so hard for. The Women's World Championship in the balance. All eyes are on this match for the Women's World Championship. With this kind of prize on the line, you just know this will be a knockdown, drag out fight. I'd expect nothing less. These women are convinced that this is their moment, their time, that this title is theirs for the taking. Oh. Across the top rope. Set up in the corner of the ring. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Thrown to the outside. Precarious position for the opposition. Perched on the ropes. Oh my, guillotine leg drop. Whoa. This one is headed outside, guys. Slam. Bam. Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. Unmitigated demons. A single leg camel to a great counter. Turning the tables there. Double. Uh-oh. Ripley with the wherewithal to counter. Counter after counter. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Six. Hey! Reversal! Can she capitalize? Impressive defense stops Ripley. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. We know Rhea Ripley possesses an immense amount of power. Corey, is that enough for her to take home the win here tonight? A superstar like Rhea Ripley isn't at their peak because of one attribute. And frankly, you should know that, Cole. Rhea Ripley is successful because she has tremendous ring IQ and dominating presence. That's something that takes years for people to learn. Saw that one coming. Hooking it up here, what's next? Both handles suplex. Here's the pin title on the line. Great officiating as the ref noticed she was on the ropes. Solely focused on. Oh, ferocious in their approach on the champion, trying to make sure the champ won't have a leg to stand on. Nice takedown by Becky, looking for the armbar. This could end it all. It is cinched in deep. Think about all of the pace. Oh, this trap as she gets away. She has her target, weighed and measured. One, two, no. Slingshot sent on to the outside. 
No sign of hesitation. And that risk gained big rewards. knowing she has to pull out all the stops now. And now thrown back into the ring. With a championship on the line. And she fights it off. What does she have to do to put her away? I'm asking myself the same question. I have no idea. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop. Rhea Ripley looking for the submission. Look at this power with the prism trap. She is determined to escape. She avoids the attack completely. Lynch saw it coming. Becky. Power with the man slam. The champ's eyes look glazed over. Complete insanity. Still holding on to the title by the skin of their teeth. You have to imagine the gears are turning in Becky's head, wondering what she has to do now to end this. Oh, look at this. Show it off with a big flex. And then a... Oh, and a stomp right to the back. Impressive reversal there. Uh-oh. German suplex. Ooh. Ah, striking with an A. a dire situation right now. Uh oh! Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off! And now that terrible error makes this a critical moment in the match. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop! And Ripley still inflicting damage late into the battle. Yeah, Rhea continuing to soften up the competition here. Snap! Pile driver! And she knew Ripley's game plan. Sight set on her opponent now. This match is coming down to the last second. Someone's got to get back to the ring now. This is likely going to have adverse effects on her. She's only aggravating her competition at this point. Why is she... At last, this grueling match has ended. Putting a stop to and all her showboating. WWE Women's World Champion, Rhea Ripley. A count out is always a tough way to lose. 
The referee's count is more than enough time to get back in the ring. The loser only has themselves to blame. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. That is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Gunther is here and ready to prove that the match is sacred. This man approaches WrestleMania with the same cold demeanor as every fight. Gunther doesn't let all the fanfare of this stage affect his mindset at all. That focus helped him successfully defend the Intercontinental title at WrestleMania 39. And that victory made him the first Austrian to ever win at the Showcase of Immortals. The brighter the lights, the more brutal and physical Gunther will get. Looking to add another major WrestleMania win to his record. Sami Zayn is ready for a fight. And it is going to be a good one. Listen to the energy in here for Sami Zayn. Well, we've learned that Zayn and these WrestleMania crowds have a very special bond. Their cheers fuel them to capture tag team gold with Kevin Owens in a main event match. One of the most emotional WrestleMania moments we've ever seen. Well, WrestleMania is where Sammy was set free from the bloodline and proved his main event status. Hoping to deliver another memorable win for this crowd. Introducing the challenger from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, Gunther! And his opponent from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Sammy Zayn! Who's going to lay claim to the workhorse title here tonight? So much. 
much history attached to the Intercontinental Championship. So much weight attached to this match. Yeah, but right now it's all about living in the present, in the now. That's the only way the champ's gonna get out of this with his title in tow. And he sends him into the corner. Solely focused on punishing the leg. Our champion is doing everything possible to make sure their opponent can't stand up. Zane with a takedown. Oh. The coaching clock. How's he going to get out of this predicament? Elbows his way out. Oh, he dropped. out of the ring. What's next? Nice drop kick. What's coming next? A back suplex. Devastating kick. Zayn dodges just in time. Here we go. Inverted DDT. Fight. Uh-oh. Gunther shifts that to his favor. He's testing fate here in danger of a count out. Quick return to the ring. And they just got back in. Lock. Springboard. Whoa, DDT. And uh oh, I think Gunther might have gotten cut there. We've seen Gunther stop people dead in their tracks with a single thunderous blow. How do you deal with an opponent like him? You have to weaken him all while making yourself a hard target. So be selective with your attacks and try to land blows to the legs or midsection. That'll help cut the big man down to size. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Gotta hurt. That kind of force in the arm can have lingering effects. Draped upside down in a tree of woe. Tied up in the tree of woe. Oh, backstabber! Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Oh, pinpoint kick to the back. Gunther seems unable to turn the momentum here. Some very selective offense against Gunther. Whittling the big man down while also attempting to avoid his grasp. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Champ's got the pin to retain. The challenger wriggles out in one. Still has enough energy for the simple kick out. Ah, oh, look at this. Just cranking it out. Just cranking the head. Right in the mouth, relentless. Enough already. Zane's feeling it. Gunther has to create an opportunity to retaliate. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Oh, a wicked kick to the lower back. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out. Including us! Oh man, he is more than fired up right now. Boom! 
Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Back suplex. Spine crushing. Many a match has turned on that kind of contact with the apron. This could be a key moment in this. Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. Dragon sleeper. Up. Clever escape. Looking for a high-risk move. He has him right where he wants him. Hammer cut. Up high. You gotta be kidding me. Just crashing down with high impact. Here we go. Your favorite call. Blue Thunder Bomb. Signature offense from Sammy. Oh, taking this one back to the ring now. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Nasty stop to finish it off. Oh. oh, wicked kick to the lower back. The challenger is in some big trouble. Might want to walk it off or shake it off or do whatever he needs to do to get his head in the game here. Got surprised there. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly played. Oh, a kick from Sami Zayn. But champions need to finish the job. Shoulders down. And he's still in the game. There was almost just lights out on their championship dreams. Let's see if that kick out was a spark or is it the challenger's last gasp. Look at Sammy's eyes. Zane absolutely thought that was going to do the trick. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. And Guther now finding himself on the wrong side of momentum. Sammy Zane has got everything going exactly how he wants it. High risk territory for Zane. We're going to finish it off. to keep this match going. Watch out! Suicide dive! Whatever it takes to win. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. I'm starting to wonder if these superstars even have breaking points. Right, we're well beyond that now, Saxton. We're so far out in the deep waters, it might as well be the abyss. Oh, man. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. He reverses it. Now's a chance for Gunther to get back into this match. Oh my goodness! 
Ah, oh, what a smash! That is just insulting. Hoisted up. And frozen. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm is shifted. Based on what we just saw, I think this match is far from over. Who knows what that kick out cost. The champ might be running on fumes. It is just unbelievable. And Guther's tank has got to be running low, guys. I don't know what his game plan is now. Sami Zayn retaliates. Defensive instincts need to kick in. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Gunther has him lined up. Finds room and lands a jawbreaker. Quick exchange of counters there. Gunther wants to finish this. A power bomb. The title's in jeopardy here. I think the paradigm is shifted. The champ kicks out at two. We knew it was not going to be an easy task to put the champion away, and that's being proven right now. More like the champions proving that sooner perish than lose their title. And Guther definitely thought that would put him down. I can't imagine he's going to take it easy on him after such a defiant kick out. The volume in this building has increased exponentially. The fans are willing these competitors to push forward. Win or lose, these superstars are going to be held in high esteem after this one. Really working over the body. Zayn looking helpless to every attack. Yeah, Gunther with impressive offense. 
Climbing the turnbuckle now. Perched up top. A diving knee drop. Just punched him right in the mouth. Zane is bleeding. Throwing kicks like that are less about injury, more about insult. Yeah. He foiled that attack. Sami Zayn digging deep, looking to turn the tides of this matchup. Zayn off the ropes. And Punk's awaited with a drop kick. Power drop kick. Covered by the champ. And the champ stands tall once again. Here is your winner, and still, WWE Intercontinental Champion, Sami Zayn. Big win as he retains the championship. Statement made. He wants everyone to know this is his title. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the World Heavyweight Championship! From chosen one to number one. A man who has slain every competitor on his way to reach the mountaintop in WWE. Scottish warrior on the battlefield. 
at the showcase of the Immortals. Who could forget that incredible moment for Drew McIntyre when he won the WWE Championship in the main event of WrestleMania 36. Something tells me the countdown to Claymore has already begun. The Scottish Warrior prepared for battle. Take a look at an athlete who exists on a level unto himself. Seth Rollins is a fighter, a survivor, and he is on a quest for greatness. And the WWE Universe is singing his praises. Crowd is singing louder than ever on the grandest stage of them all. Seth Rollins at WrestleMania is a whole mood. Yeah, at WrestleMania, Seth Rollins has crushed internet sensations and crushed uh, energy drink bottles. Don't forget about facing his WrestleMania nightmare in the form of Cody Rhodes. Nobody does mania like Rollins. Only the biggest names, the toughest opponents can share the ring with Rollins at Mania. Introducing the challenger from Ayr, Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, the Scottish warrior, Drew McIntyre. And his opponent from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the world heavyweight champion, Ladies and gentlemen, this is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Each man in their corner awaiting the bell for what should prove to be one of the most challenging matches of their career. Guys, this one has that big fight feel tonight with the World Heavyweight Championship being contested for. Yeah, Michael, and that's exactly what this title stands for. Challenging for it is one of the most demanding situations a superstar can find themselves in. And defending it is even a greater challenge. Take down, looking for the cross face. It's cinched in, this could be over. They're gonna free the arm and does just that. What to do next? Just tossed. She get airline miles for that. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. minute now looking for a high risk high reward situation sky high nobody home Rollins got out of the oh god 
Seth retaliates. Seth Rollins hooking up his opponent. Small package driver. Taking this to the floor, he returns to the ring. Getting him into the corner. Ouch. Rollins lining up. Springboard knee. McIntyre's spirit might have wavered there a bit. Yeah, as Rollins was putting that visionary offensive mindset to work. What now? Oh, not to the belly! Has the challenger pinned? Is this it? Gets the shoulder up after one there. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough. And the pace is quick and courtesy of Seth Rollins. And there's the deadliness of Seth freaking Rollins, showing he can be flashy and lethal. Oof. Had it scouted and met by the back elbow. Whoa. Setting foot in the ring now. McIntyre basically telling him that this is what dominance really looks like. He's returning fire. And now... Straight to the knee. We know that taking out the legs is one of the most effective strategies in any match. Great counter! Seth Rollins. Oh, Vintage Falcon Arrow. The challenger is not in a great place. Yeah, Rollins at this stage getting visions of winding this battle down. Rollins from up high. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. Up high. Whoa, across his body. The champion taking the high risk option to retain the title. Two counts. He narrowly avoids the count. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Elbow. 
He finds a counter to McIntyre there. Left by the turnbuckles. Oh, he's got him where he wants him. Here we go. Landing a huge and attempt for the championship. And he fights it off. He just won't give up. Seth Rollins' arrogance on full display with that gesture. McIntyre must be getting phased by this attack. And McIntyre is just getting totally cut off by Seth. We've reached the point where you have to question who has more left in the tank. Is it McIntyre or is it Rollins? Neither of them could have much left. No way, no how. Oh, moonsault! That's gotta be it. The champion. Here is your winner, and still world heavyweight champion, Seth Freaking Rollins. And he has to be satisfied with himself defending the championship like he did. This was a great title defense from the champion. Yeah, that's off to the champion. They could not be kept down in this one. The following contest is a no holds barred match and is for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. The WWE Universe just exploded. The American Nightmare Cody Rhodes looks as ready as ever for action tonight. The Rhodes name means he was born with this business in his blood. He's finally been able to tap into that, and we are now witnessing his full capabilities. Indeed, Corey, the American Nightmare has become a reality. From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins.
And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do, and that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. Make way for the head of the table. I think we can all agree we are seeing a once-in-a-lifetime competitor. Over 1,200 plus days as Universal Champion, the third longest reigning world champion in WWE history. Three plus years of dominance, dozens of successful title defenses. Yeah, it's got to feel like pure intimidation when you are facing Roman Reigns. It may even feel like victory is virtually impossible. Reigns is firmly established as the head of the table and has no intention of being unseated. Looking at a man who's about to come face to face with his greatest nightmare. Unfortunately for him, this is one nightmare you can't wake up from. You've got to live through it. Cody will make sure of it. Introducing the challenger from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! And his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion Roman Reigns! The championship of all championships and the biggest prize in WWE.
Possession of this title puts you in a league of your own. This is what we've been waiting for. A match to decide the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. The crowd has been buzzing about this all day. Anytime a title of this magnitude is up for grabs, it generates an unbelievable level of excitement. The question on everyone's mind is who walks out champion? A question that we'll soon have an answer for. He had it scouted. Elbow drop, knee crusher, just relentless. Lean hard, placed upon the left knee. Hard for the champ to have any answers when endless strikes are being rained down on him. Dropping the bow. Back suplex, no. Driven down. Oh, stop, stop, stop. And the forearm smash. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Oh, man, he grabbed the kendo stick. Everyone needs to watch out now. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. He might get caught. Dangerous position here, guys. Oh, no, 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 Back no. Suplex. Nasty. The hardest part of the ring. After that attack on the apron, there is no way we're seeing them leave this arena without medical assistance. In a no disqualification match, you never want to be the superstar on the wrong end of a chair or a kendo stick or whatever else might be hiding under the ring. You want to be the one inflicting that punishment because that's how you control the pace and the match as a whole. And if the first stop doesn't send you the message, the follow-up ones definitely will. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a submission here. Camel clutch! And it is a single leg camel clutch and a great counter. Thrown back in under the ropes. And he's pulled the ring apron up, looking under there for something. He's got a table. We know where this is going, gentlemen. Re-entering the ring now. Springboard off. Bam! Down he goes. Reigns really having his way right here. Cody feeling the sheer dominance of Reigns. Sidewalk slam! Almost drove him through the ring. A bad place to be for the challenger. Reigns just sent a message with that kind of attack. That one fails to land. Missed the mark. He eludes the contact. Oh! And now Rhodes can't stop this momentum. 
And bit by now a pen for the championship. Oh, and quick resiliency from the challenger. What stamina. It's truly impressive to completely beat the count here. to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. And he gets set back into the ring. <laughs> Caught with a punch. The challenger is in some big trouble. Yeah, this man... Reigns in the corner. The title's going nowhere. Kiss your dreams. Good night. Is it enough? The cover. There's two. And the kick out. And look at the disbelief on the face of the champion. They both know what's at stake. Neither competitor is going to lose easy here. And Reigns absolutely can't believe it. But he cannot let that slow him down. Cody Rhodes felt that coming. Reversal after reversal. These two. Roman Reigns so dominant. DT to climb. Oh my goodness, Cody's close to. He did it. Roman Reigns holds on to the title. Here is your winner. of victory as he retains the title. A pretty impressive defense. Challengers might think twice before coming at him now.
the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes looking to continue his dominance in WWE. Competing at his highest level, striving for the main event and the biggest prize. He doesn't have to be impressed with the form that Cody Rhodes has taken. He's become a leader, a mentor, and a main eventer. Those are all great things to be, Saxton, but we all know what Cody truly wants to be more than anything else is a world champion. The following is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds. The American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins. And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do. And that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. has crushed internet sensations and crushed uh, energy drink bottles. Don't forget about facing his WrestleMania nightmare in the form of Cody Rhodes. Nobody does mania like Rollins. Only the biggest names, the toughest opponents can share the ring with Rollins at mania. Excuse me. He's the trailblazing, eyebrow-raising phenomenon. The great one, ready for action.
make way for the head of the table. I think we can all agree we are seeing a once-in-a-lifetime competitor. Representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! WrestleMania, acknowledge him! Plenty of WrestleMania history for the Tribal Chief, defeating legends like Triple H and The Undertaker. But since taking his spot at the head of the table, he has successfully defended the same championship at three consecutive WrestleManias, defeating the likes of Brock Lesnar and Cody Rhodes. can't help but be in awe of the Tribal Chief. I agree, Saxton. This man has truly earned his spot at the head of the table. And here we go with tag team rules in effect. We are set for action and starting things off with Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. And standing across from them, it's a very tough test with The Rock and Roman Reigns. We have to be expecting a frenetic pace in this matchup. These teams stop for nothing. They are all go from bell to bell. Way. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just got to toss another person to make a statement. Figure four leg lock applied. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. 
This is agonizing. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. to that pin attempt. Knee strike! He's taking some good hits. Oh, my. Knee right to the back of the neck. I don't know if Cody can withstand much more of this. The Ross opponent needs to know his role. Tag switching it up. Back suplex, no! Driven down! He skirts away, living to fight another day. Oh! Rapid fire, Samoan drop. Can he do it here? He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of him. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. From the top. Fails to hit the bullseye. see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be in elite physical condition to pull off something like that. chemistry. Hey, I'd be a great teammate. I've seen you trip over your own left foot. No thank you. The adrenaline is pumping and the WWE Universe is on his side. Sharp elbows to the body looking to fight his way out. the tag. Quick thinking by The Rock. Counter upon counter. Great minds thinking alike. Hoist it up. Oh, stomach landing on the knee. 
Well scattered reversal there. Oh boy. German suplex. And The Rock got cut down to size there. And Rollins is wearing a self-satisfied smirk after landing that. Now that'll do some serious damage. Expected that one. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Amazing sequence from Rollins. The Rock's got to find a way to defend himself. Able to give him the slip. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Sure seems to be getting out of there in a hurry. A chance to get his thoughts together and regroup. Huh. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. And that attack certainly took its toll on The Rock. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Repositioning their opponent. Looks like a neck breaker. Ooh, bang! And the cover for the win! And the count stopped short of two. You expect these pins to last much longer at this stage in the match. Nasty right hand. Panthers with an Enziguri. Crashing to the floor. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. The millions are about to experience it. Full head of steam. Like that, Rollins dodges. Look at this. Boom, oh, nice. Rollins lining it up. Here it comes. Stop. Can that finish the rock off? The cover. Maybe not. The breakup. That's what they call me the hot shot. Tag is made, and here we go. Oh, what a close line. The American Nightmare feeling that adrenaline in his soul. He's got it. Oh, ho, ho. let's get it on. Rose just turned the lights out. Wait, 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 how can that 
be fair. Come on, ref, keep these guys in check. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right in the face. My God. How much longer can these superstars continue to fend off defeat? Every obstacle has been met with equal measures of tenacity. It's going to take a lot to close this one out. And there's the tag to Seth Rollins. Rollins looks determined. A oh, jumping knee strike. He's going. And he only stays down for a one count. He's still got more left in the tank. Kick to the gut. Right around into a neck breaker. And Seth taking some time to, well, who knows what his thought process is at this point. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. <laughs> Rollins with an homage to the game. We're going to end this emphatically. What a pedigree. Kick to the gut. Boom! DDT. Producing a trampling. Shoulders down. Shoulders shoots up before two. Somehow still in this fight. Not down and out yet. Seth Rollins, he knows how to get the crowd going. Got the tag. Got the tag. Got him where he wants him. Up and Falcon Arrow. He can't take any more of this. Yeah, this is not good. You don't say, Saxton. Yeah, the Brahma Bull has been taken by the horns. I wish someone would put you out the pasture. Uh-oh, I think Rollins might have got cut there. In full control here. Face first. Shoulder tackle after shoulder tackle. Lifts their opponent's uh -oh. legs and... That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Double leg takedown on their opponent. Trying to step through. Deadlock. Look at the torque. They Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Arm drag. He's heading up top. Thinking big. He's lining him up. From the top rope. Beautiful drop kick. And it's a tough spot now for Rhodes. The Rock not allowing the nature of this match to prevent him from getting back on top. 
The Rock has it hooked. Rock and that may end the American Nightmare. Just take a look at the WWE Universe. They know there is no better place to be than right here, right now. Oh. Looking for the suplex all the way up. Look at this power. Oh, no. Into a chop one. The Rock finally finding an answer to that onslaught. Could be the tide turner The Rock desperately needed. Uh, tag made. Oh, and a kick right to the midsection. The tribal chief has it cinched in. Kravat sleeper cinched in. He's got it locked in. It's locked in. Now would be a wise time. Oh, and he gets out. Perhaps some renewed life in him now. Rollins with the. Shaking my head in disbelief over how he managed to get the shoulder up. Looks like they're looking for a neck. There's a forearm to the back of the neck. This match's brutality starting to show on him. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course, they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Oof. Oh, man, that was nasty. They weren't that good looking anyway. Oh, man. He didn't need that eyebrow anyway. Cross the top rope all the way to the floor. Ah. Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Seth Rollins taking charge in a big way. Roman's on the wrong side of this exchange. Dismantled here, and Rollins cannot be stopped. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. And somehow, through the pain, Cody is still holding the line. Here's where Roman's ability to endure will be challenged. Oh, stomping away. Uh oh, position in measuring. Dropped to the skull. He's tagging out. Seth Rollins up the turnbuckles. Here we go. Step through. Uh-oh. 
You know what's coming next? Legendary Scorpion. Sharpshooter applied. Can the He's trying to push himself up, and that'll cause a break. Most nights Rollins would have just ended this, but not tonight. It is absolutely deafening in the building right now. Two count kick out. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. Reaches his partner for the tag. Line. Good grief. Ooh. Close line. Avoided contact and brought a big attack of their own. Uh-oh. Had that one scouted. with a defiant kick out, simply refusing to stay down. The Rock has cut some corners in the past and he might be desperate enough to do it again after that kick out, guys. Mounted with punches and not. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. With a tag is Seth Rollins. Oof, answer that with a stiff knee. With a head of steam. Big air. Yeah, it's on the neck. It is all Rollins now. Makes the cover. Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. What heart. What resilience we are seeing from The Rock. This one is not over. How often do you see Seth Rollins come up that short? That close. He's got to be livid right about now. the tag. A oh, torturous knee. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. Brody looking to end this with crossroads. Brody's put a lot of competitors out with that. Cover! And that may be one of the biggest wins in his career. Here are your winners. The team of Cody Rhodes and Seth. And the winner 
partners celebrating together. Great chemistry tonight. Really putting the sports in sports entertainment. This is a duo that really practiced their teamwork. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. That is for the WWE Women's Championship. All right, here comes Michael Cole's best friend. Great. A childhood dream to be on the grandest stage. Well, I don't see the same Bailey who used to write school papers about her dreams in this moment. That's because this Bailey inspires a generation. She is the epitome of ambition, a true role model. Like her or not, you cannot deny her skill and contributions to this division. That's true, Corey, because I can't stand her. Perhaps the best female high flyer in WWE, Io Sky. And you can never discount the backup, the control on the ground every time Io is around. Io Sky's list of titles in Japan is a mile long across every major women's division. Yeah, here in WWE, Io has continued that success, but she has something now she didn't have then. She has control. Io Sky made her mark in NXT history as one of the most accomplished superstars in the brand's entire history. Yeah, but Io's change in attitude and her new allies ensure even more success in WWE. Introducing the challenger from San Jose, California, The crowning jewel of the women's division being contested here. 
The final moments to focus on the prize before turning your attention on the competition. Every woman wants it. Few get the distinction of holding it. This match is for the WWE Women's Championship. The prestige of this title can't be overstated. Every member of our women's division covets this title and wants their turn as champion. But there can only be one, and that's about to be decided right here. Unbelievable athleticism. Speed kills, and no one knows that better than the champion. Oh, my. Dragon screw. Wow, that hurt. The champion is just systematically destroying the challenger here. Going to work on the leg, chopping them down as best as they know how. Answering back. Matt slam with some attitude. Oh my goodness! Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. And Bailey connected nicely there. Oh my gosh, what impact! The champion with his shoulder up before two. She shows that she's far from finished. Oh, that was just malicious. Insulting. That's telling your opponent, you don't deserve to share this stage with me. The proverbial mud hole has been stopped, and now it's time to walk it dry. Elbow drop! Just a blitz of offense on EO here. EO trying to withstand this surge. Belly loves to be in control of the match to dictate the flow. Corey, is there an easy way to turn that against her? Oh, absolutely, Cole. If you can disrupt Bailey's rhythm and make things difficult for her, she'll start to get very frustrated. And even the best superstars get sloppy and make mistakes when they're flustered. Dropkick hits hard, lands harder. One outside, one inside. We'll see how this unfolds as we proceed. Oh, spine buster. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Yeah, EO Sky looked energized on that one. Both wrists captured and that was nasty. Oh, yeah. Bullseye with the drop kick. 
You suffer a direct hit like that, and it's tough to move. Isolating their opponent's arm and oh! Delivering nasty stumps! Taking all their frustrations out on the champion and doing so in the most inelegant way possible. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Bailey's asserting some dominance now. This is Bailey looking at her best. Kick right to the leg. Oh, what a kick! That kick will stop you in your tracks. The champ has been taken to their limit. Truly fighting to the last breath, but we might be coming up on that soon. From the top rope! Elbow dropped by Bailey. Oh, no. No one expected this. You know, she's got some serious nerve trying to cause some sort of distraction now. It's brilliant.
drive. And Io keeps on powering through to remain on the attack. Bailey needs to flip the switch or risk losing this one. She's trying so desperately to get back up to her feet. Watch out. Look out below. You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. For comfort. Oh, no one's paying attention to you, Saxon. They're too busy beating the tar out of each other. Oh, leg breaker! And Eo is in command. Not allowing Bailey to dictate the flow, trying to disrupt her rhythm. This has to be very frustrating for Bailey. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. The role model, not exactly a baby. Ooh, refusing to let her get into her head. To the outside. This could get wild. She sent back in under the ropes. She's going up. Top rope here from the top. No, 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 no. Oh, a piercing elbow. And Bailey is really being knocked around here. And I don't think anything can stop EO now. She just will not go away. Play it possum! Whoa, play it possum! No, she kicks out. Good Lord, scarily close to three. Free their opponent's arm, has the arm trapped. Goodness gracious. Oh, that was just malicious. Insulting. Stalling! Butterfly backbreaker! Nice scoop slam! Eel bursts to the top rope! Look out! She comes up empty. Oh, strong impact. Each competitor wants to prove that they are the toughest woman walking God's green earth. I cannot believe the punishment these superstars are inflicting on one another. Ah, caught in the chin. Foot to the midsection. This is just establishing dominance. Oh, I stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? EO in a daze. Could be over soon. Bailey delivering the kick to the gun.
whatever, but you can't deny that the earlier distraction had catastrophic repercussions throughout the match. They tried to tune out the added presence, but it ultimately proved to be too much for them. You hate to see it. Simply one of the best to ever do it. The following contest is a triple threat match. And is for the WWE United States Championship. Introducing the challenger from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the Viper. Randy Orton! You know, Randy Orton watched his father in the very first WrestleMania main event, and then he went on to main event multiple WrestleManias of his own. Now, this is a stage where he's faced the likes of The Undertaker, Triple H, and John Cena. We have seen Randy Orton go from being known as a legend killer to a legend. And we know Orton only needs three letters to create the ultimate WrestleMania moment. R-K-O. Well, Randy Orton has made a career out of psychologically dissecting his opponents. And many of the victims who have fallen for the Viper schemes stay down for good. Writes his own story. In Venom, Randy Orton can't be controlled. Kevin Owens has arrived. Time to fight Owens fight. And introducing the challenger from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens! KO Mania is in full effect. Owens has delivered some classic WrestleMania matches over his career. He's battled against former friends here, even reforged brotherhoods inside this ring. Well, he's taken on any and all comers and even brought a living legend out of retirement. Well, whether or not there's a championship on the line, Kevin Owens always goes big at KO Mania.
Ladies and gentlemen, the social media icon has arrived. And introducing the champion from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 205 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, Logan Paul. He's just as flashy as ever. He belongs on the WrestleMania stage. Logan Paul certainly loves soaking up the spotlight. Knows how to make a WrestleMania caliber entrance. Remember when he wrote a zip line to the ring? <laughs> well, WrestleMania is all about turning things up, and Logan's great at that. Could be another great WrestleMania performance for Paul. All right, guys, I cannot wait for this match. Or for that matter, Logan's next podcast. You're really trying to get a guest spot, aren't you, Corey? So? Corey's got his own podcast, you idiot. The bell rings and we are set for a United States Championship battle in this triple threat match with Logan Paul, Randy Orton, and Kevin Owens. And you know these odds do not favor the champion, but that's what defending the title is all about. DDT! Oh my god, a DDT! Spike! Oh, shot right to the kidney! Randy Orton hoisting up his opponent. Ball away slam! Trying to put the champ out of sort, maybe even discombobulate them. He went right into that turnbuckle. Powerless position to be in right now. Ooh, nasty shot to the throat. Shots to the body. Heavy hands. Every ounce of the body is a target. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Settling on the kendo stick. No good can come from this. And this match will head back to the ring. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. The steel chair. Never as innocent as it looks. Look, I know it may sound cliche, but with triple threat matches, you've always got to keep your head on the swivel. Always got to know when to pick your spot, even if you form an alliance. It won't last. That's just the nature of the game. Good defense. Oh, Rapid man. fire right hands. Showing absolutely no mercy at all. What an onslaught. Pulled in from belly to belly. Look at this. Boom. Nice. And Paul could have all the natural ability in the world, but it didn't prepare him for that. And Owen's able to reverse it. Fire in the 
this is what I wish you would do. Go home! That's a forearm that'll floor you. to stop Owens. Logan Paul, I can't believe he's going to attempt this. There's one. Paul spins the hips. Paying homage, of course, to Eddie Guerrero. Delivers his second. And now Logan Paul looking for... He's heading back to the ring. He hit the three amigos. What a counter. Ow! Oh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. We are European uppercut. Big overhand. Oh, using the top rope. Has an advantage. You ain't cheating, you ain't trying. That showed a complete lack of respect for your competition and for our sport. Exploder suplex. Oh, with authority. Fishing for something beneath the ring. And he's going with the great equalizer here. The steel chair. The effects of this match are showing on the chair. It's expected, Cole. In a triple threat match, the target on your back is twice the size. Moonsault. Quick attack. Oh, new champ. Working in interference. right in the head. And what's he looking for here? Big. The champion into the cover. Oh, and he breaks up the pin. Stomping. Ouch. Hooked up. And... Logan Paul feeling on top of the world and letting him know it. The sheer force of that landing was probably enough to fracture a few bones. I don't know what they're looking for here. Whoa, not quite yet. Shades of the old EC dub as a kendo stick is introduced to the proceedings. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Ooh, dropped well in the face. their opponent now getting back into the ring
What's he open to find down there? I guarantee that chair is not going to be used as it was designed for. Oh, my God. My goodness, did you hear that chop? Great reversal. The paradigm is shifted, broken up, and the match continues. Oh, Jordan. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Taking it outside the ring now. He'll take things into the ring. Raining down right hands. And he hightails it to ringside. He certainly has to be piecing together a new game plan now. And he heads out of the ring. No count outs, no worries. What a shot. Straight brutality. A big mound of salt being added to the wound by KO. The challenger not looking good right now. This should come as no surprise. In a havoc-filled triple threat, you're going to take some big hits. We have seen these men unleash a lot of devastating offense. Incredible that this match hasn't ended yet. It might just be a matter of time. This one is close to coming to a head. The incredible self-confidence of Logan Paul on full display. for the championship. He breaks the pin. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Stuck in the tree of woe. No escape in sight. So 
intimidation tactics from Logan Paul. and there's no count outs in this one. some fight left. just wants to end things. Kevin Owens with the evasion. the pin. Oh, catch 
a kick to the face. Fist right on the temple. The champ will stay champ. For sure. Oh my goodness! Here's the pin tunnel on the line. Go! And he stops the count. Ah, uh, shots to the body. Big right hook. his opponent from the top turnbuckle. From the top! Slot time bomb from KO! He climbs into the ring. 
Logan Paul is in big jeopardy here. Oh, man. Caught an elbow to the gut for that effort. Probably not going to win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? Because the Billy Goat's curse is in effect. Oh, I can't stand this. And he chooses to let go of the hold. But just the amount of time he was in that submission could be very significant. Logan making it clear he has his number. Climbs back inside. He steps foot in the ring again. Uh -oh. Stop! The chip off with glazed over. He stops the count. Ooh. Logan Paul's eyes tracking the opposition. skin of their teeth and don't expect the champ to start going easy on him now and i get that paul thought he had him there but he really needs to follow up he can't let time cost him this match okay. that just happened the champ's eyes were glazed over and the count's broken keeping the match alive vicious right for him. He got whipped into that corner. Close line in the corner. Whoa, that was a stick chair shot to the door. Boom! Oh, man. These are dangerous attacks on their own, but now the damage is exponentially multiplying. Here we go! The Explorer! Orton not intimidated. Not even close. If anything, he's the one doing the intimidating right now, Michael. Orton... Uh-oh! Stunner! Orton hits the stunner! The title's in jeopardy here! I think the paradigm has shifted. And he stonewalls Logan. Here is your winner, and new WWE United States Champion, Kevin.
He won the match and the championship with it. A great blend of tenacity and physical skill brings home the gold. Winning a championship in WWE is no small feat. Take a look at the new champ. A man who's been champion everywhere he's ever competed. The phenomenal AJ Styles. And guess what? He's not showing any signs of slowing down. The following contest is scheduled for one thumb. Making his way to the ring, representing the O. From Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ Styles. This is a man who is always looking to steal the show and win titles. Endless confidence in his abilities with his proven track record. And no doubt about it, Cole Styles is excellence personified. Truly second to none in the ring. It's time to get out of the way. The fastest rising star is in the building. And we're about to see whose game it is. And his opponent from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 241 pounds, L.A. Knight. L.A. Knight will hand out a beat down to anybody, any night of the week. It doesn't matter to him. This guy has never met a spotlight he didn't like, but I'll give credit where it's due. When you're as good as L.A. Knight, you shine bright naturally. L.A. Knight is ready, and this one's official. Knight is out here not just to grab the spotlight, but to take what he thinks is rightfully his. At one point, Knight's dream of competing in WWE seemed like just a figment of Knight's imagination. Now Knight is making up for lost time, and as he says, taking out the trash. But he's dealing with an exceptional opponent in AJ Styles. AJ is as innovative as they come in terms of in-ring tactics and offense. He's just got a brain for this business. Yeah, there's no telling what Styles will pull out when he's in the ring. He's always ready to break new ground with bold maneuvers if he thinks it'll get him closer to the win. Ooh. Ham 
hamstring crushing knee strikes. Repeated strikes. Practically never ending blows. Coming at full force here. Oh, that hurt right in the kidney. Golly. Shoved into the ropes and attacking the lower back. Put into the corner now. Got them right in the corner. What are they doing here? Yeah, oh, oh, hip drop. Not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. Yeah. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Styles is on another level right now. You can't deny the precision we're seeing from AJ. Up high. From ring post to ring side, risking it all paid off. And the phenomenal AJ Styles certainly earns his name. The question is how you contend with someone like that. Simply put, you have to be at your best and do everything you can to match AJ's talent. Rising to his level is easier said than done, but from the top, elbow drop. Good Lord. Into the pin attempt. He's able to kick out before two. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Moonsault. Reverse DDT for Styles. Are you kidding me? Oh, strong knee connects. He's able to fend off the attack. Slam. Well, they say everyone has a plan until they get punched in the mouth. Well, someone just threw their plan out the window. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Straight impact on the throat. Oh, my goodness. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Now oh, trampling the opposition. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Honing in on the arm. And Styles has taken a lot of offense now. AJ's opponent actually rising to Styles' level by the looks of things. The clothesline. Styles gets out of the way. He's turning the tables. Could be a chance for Styles to change the complexion of this match. Lands the elbow. An impressive sequence from L.A. Knight. A.J.'s got to find a window to fight back. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Uh. Uh. 
ropes him up. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh my God, he's in position. LA Knight is done for the win. One. Two. No, he beats the cat. He is just barely still in the fight. I don't know how many more times he's going to be able to kick out after that. That was two. AJ Styles rolls through. And the ropes forced the break. He did not want to be caught up in that submission any longer. Look at this. Oh, boy. Explorer! His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. performance we've come to expect from AJ.
Here comes big Bronson Reed. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Black Forest, South Australia. Weighing in at 330 pounds, Bronson Reed. The kaiju of WWE, big Bronson Reed. He has been on an absolute tear as of late. We've seen him beat some big names, compete in some major matches. I think it's just a matter of time before Bronson really hits it big. Gentlemen, big Bronson Reed is ready to claw Thanks through the, the competition. Sun. And I don't think anyone can stop him. This is one intimidating superstar. I agree with you, Saxton. I pity those who pick a fight with Braun Breaker. And his opponent from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds, Braun Breaker. We've seen a fury to Braun Breaker, a fiery temper that fuels him in the ring. And that fire cannot be extinguished. drive on paper all the attributes of a top talent yeah Braun Breaker just seems destined for very big things big 
Bronson Reed really is a force of nature, isn't he? Just a colossal superstar with a high-impact, high-intensity offense to match. You got that right about his offense, Cole. The tsunami says it all. Tangling with this mammoth of a man is no easy task. Absolutely, Corey. This matchup should be quite the collision. But then we have a man who's a certified threat to any superstar, Braun Breaker. Braun has that special competitive fire inside of him, that drive to do whatever it takes to capture the win. I agree. It's hard to imagine. From the top. Diving elbow Are you kidding me? Is it enough? Two count. He gets the shoulder up at two. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Staved off that attack. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Someone down with authority. So ruthless. Corey, we've seen the immense success. His shoulders are down. No, he kicks out. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Front face lock applied. It's about to get more painful. Top oh. row suplex. Top rope. Here we go. From the top. Diving elbow. Are you kidding me? Someone get the spatula. We have a human being to scrape up. Very close. The T clearly set again. Getting him into the corner. Big impact in the corner. Nobody home for the clothesline. Pressure being kept on Braun. Yeah, the Ozilla is proving hard to keep up with. Comes crashing down. Bronson Reed put all of his 300 plus pounds behind that attack. to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Ron Drager looking for Old Faithful. The Steiner recline. You can feel him desperately trying to find a way, and he does. Uh-oh. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. Knew what was coming there. And Reed with a counter. 
Showing out their deadlifting prowess and just... Tossing them aside. He's looking a little... We got a cover! Major, major win! That'll change his career tonight! Here is your winner, Bronson. Bronson Reed bullies his way to the win. The big man, Bronson Reed, just stomped right through the competition. What, weren't you surprised? Make way for the man. A woman who's done it all, but always wants a fight. She is as tough as they come. Yeah, Becky Lynch has had to overcome countless challenges in her career both in and out of the ring. You know, she's the first female competitor to hold two world titles at the same time. Rhea Ripley is here, and everyone else better run for cover. 
The Eradicator ready to annihilate the entire women's division. A pile of championship title wins, a Royal Rumble winner. Rhea Ripley is a 100% proven threat. No questioning that. You talk about nightmare opponents. Rhea Ripley is the living embodiment of that concept. It takes a lot of courage to step inside the ring with her. Courage or foolishness. Dealing with a competitor on Ripley's level is a challenge that most superstars just aren't up to, period. She's that strong, that smart, and that deadly. Ready or not, Rhea Ripley is coming for her competition tonight. Introducing the challenger from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch! And her opponent from Adelaide, Australia, the WWE Women's World Champion, Rhea Ripley! The referee letting our competitors take one final look at what this match will be all about. The decorated Women's World Championship. The Women's World Championship on the line here in this matchup. Whoever wins this one, no doubt, we're looking at the unequivocal top dog of the women's division. Without a doubt, Corey, the top prize in the division up for grabs. Ooh, that foils Lynch. Sent into the corner. Intercepted by the man. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. Oh. Hip toss across. And an elbow drop to the arm. to the leg. Oh, foot just stomping down. Going right after the arm and taking down their opponent effectively. Just twisting. Ooh. Just turn that around. Oof, kick finds it. She manages to get control. Strong oh, kick. My goodness.
timely reversal on Lynch. Out of the ring, she has to mind the 10 count. Oh my gosh! You know, Rhea Ripley is all about methodically destroying her opponents in the ring. So if I was taking her on, I'd try to control the tempo and make her compete at my speed, not allowing her to find a good offensive rhythm. Not a bad idea. That might just be enough to throw Ripley off her game. She's in the ring now. Right to the kidneys from behind. Boom. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Referee's count at seven. They need to get back into the ring. What now? What now? Driven into the barricade, spine first. Here we go. Suicide dive! Unbelievable athleticism. Just going for it all and landing a direct hit. Becky holds her off. Becky Lynch with a great shot. And now the gears are turning for Becky. Just like I was saying, trying to control the tempo and keep Rhea from finding her rhythm. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. No way. Soaring out of the ring, looking to do as much damage as possible. Stops the kick. Flipped over the... That's the landing. <laughs> Big leg drop. And Becky's toughness certainly got tested by that hit. Ripley's displaying that cutthroat approach to competition, sparing no pity for her opponent right now. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. This Be might be the beginning of the end. Manhandled slam. The title might change hands. Is it enough? The cover! Two! Now she kicked out. Champion there. Uh, well, we might see a new champ here tonight. Don't put the cart before the horse. The champ kicked out and has no intentions on losing that title anytime soon. And Becky Lynch is fuming. She did all that work and still it wasn't enough. Breaker. <laughs> Becky Lynch. It's the ropes, connects with a leg drop, and more to come. A second leg drop with a twist. Oh, look out. Leg drop from the ropes. And Becky... What now? Oh, yes! Things just got very, very interesting. This is getting out of control. Yeah, trying to take advantage. From behind, score point. Shoulders down. The count late in the match, but somehow has the incomparable power to kick out before the one count. Oh, and a lariat followed by a, another lariat. 
Oh, my Ripcord God. drop kick. Ripley looking to force her opponent into submission. Trying to get her to tap out. You feel like hope is starting to... And she lets her free. But the damage was certainly done, Michael. Rhea, top turnbuckle. From the top. Elbow drop. The challenger is not in a great place. And as this fight goes on, Rhea is reaching new levels of brutality. She kicks out with force. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Mounting a downed opponent, and look at them go. Over and over and over again. And a slap for the exclamation point. Playing possum! Whoa! After two. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. And Rhea finds a counter. Double wrist lock. Oh, flapjack. Covered by the champ. Retains. No. Challenger kicks out. This is going to come down to who wants it more. She shoots up the top rope. Dangerous thinking. From the top. You gotta be kidding me. Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. The WWE Universe on the edge of their seats, waiting to see which way this ends. Every movement, every attack could be the pivotal point in this match. Rhea Ripley looking to force her opponent into submission. The prism trap is in. And she releases the hold as she feels that enough damage has been done. Should have kept on wrenching. Why show mercy now? Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Momentum clearly on the side of Ripley. Becky's fighting spirit needs to cause a change here. Coming up next, Ripley's got her hooked. Rip time. Now that is why they're the champ. Makes the cover. Kick out, still has hope. Just barely able to kick out. I thought the champ had it in the bag. This is how much the championship means. You can see the sweat drip out of the challengers every pour. And frustration is starting to set in for Rhea Ripley. She's not... Becky Lynch looking for it. And here's the slam. We can have a new champion. Cover. Two. No, no, they kicked out. The champion kicked out. I knew it would take more than that to put the champ away. But just how much more is needed? The end could still be right around the corner. You know, Becky is feeling a dissatisfaction with the outcome of that pin count. She thought she had it. This packed house is going absolutely nuts. They don't want this match to end. No way. Suicide dive. Pinpoint precision right on target. Uh-oh. Great awareness as she proves to be too quick. Got it. 
And the champ adds to their legacy. Here is your winner, and still the WWE Women's World Korea Rampling! Celebrate this win. You deserve it for focusing up and keeping your eye on the ball. Props to them for not letting the distractions get to them, to tuning out the noise and getting the job done. If anything, the distraction worked as the perfect motivation to get them into gear. I don't hear a thank you, though. Corey, I just don't get how your mind works sometimes. The Apex Predator is on the hunt. Making his way to the ring from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton! Randy Orton looking so ready for this ambulance match to get himself his first win in this totally unique stipulation. That ambulance match loss you're alluding to was a hellacious match that could have gone either way. But Orton's never been one to live in the past. I'm sure he learned what he could from that match and is now totally focused on the contest right in front of him. One thing we know for certain, ambulance matches reward ruthlessness, and the Viper has no shortage of that. He must be prepared for battle against one of the toughest competitors in all of sports entertainment. And if he is, it'll be one of the most memorable moments in his entire career. The WWE Universe just exploded. The American Nightmare Cody Rhodes looks as ready as ever for action tonight.
his opponent from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! The Rhodes name means he was born with this business in his blood. He's finally been able to tap into that, and we are now witnessing his full capabilities. Indeed, Corey, the American Nightmare has become a reality. For everything Rhodes has accomplished during his tenures in WWE, he's made his mark across the wrestling world. Every promotion he stepped foot in has been transformed for the better, thanks to the American Nightmare. But we all know he's got the best work ahead of him here in WWE. The following contest is an ambulance match! There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent into the ambulance by any means necessary. After closing both doors, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner! Now, let the match begin! That ambulance looming over these competitors here tonight. What's normally a sign of help and rescue tonight is an albatross of a defeat that has to be weighing heavy on the minds of these combatants. Yeah, Corey, but you got to keep your focus here. You can't lose sight of the task at hand. That's mounted with punches and not... And a Oof. stomp to the gut, too. Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Uh oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, oh. man. You want to control the tempo. You want to dictate the pace. That right there is how you do it. Orton measuring him. A knee smash. He saw it coming, taking advantage. And now thrown back into the ring. Swinging those ambulance doors open. Could have one thing in mind. He's taking this to the floor now. Wards off that offense from Cody. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Corey, so many things can become your enemy in a match like this. How does a competitor avoid having the ambulance doors shut on them? What you do in the ring is important to grab the advantage, but you need to maintain control all the way to the ambulance. Dragging a motionless body might prove to be the hardest challenge. With the reversal! Close line! The Viper able to strike back. Being carried around with ease. Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. It's on the apron. You don't aim for the apron unless you're looking to do some serious damage. something to prove in this fight. Yeah, Orton showed there that he still hasn't lost his predatory instinct. Great wherewithal on the counter. Kick to the gut. Oh, brutal for him. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. This bat is such a dangerous weapon in his hands right now. Oh, oh what a kick. Yeah. 
Head first into the ambulance. Appears to be completely defenseless right now. This is a hell of a struggle. Just try to pull up. There's no way this is happening. They escaped. Miraculous. You saw the original. How about the director's cut? Bam! Down he goes. He's getting a little battered now. Oh. Running elbow drop on target. He's looking for an implement of destruction under the ring. He has a Kendall stick in hand, and this place just turned into South Swanson Street. Boom! Oh! One wicked attack after another. He fends off the attack. These are the kind of attacks that completely throw off your equilibrium. Cody Rhodes is just having his way here. And Orton needs to bring the match back to his pace. Ambulance doors are open. Gotta wake up now before it's too late. Oh. The adrenaline is pumping and the WWE Universe is on his side. Trying to at least slam one door shut. Halfway to victory. How did they escape? That's incredible. What resolve. Smart strategy attacked the knee. Rose gets out of dodge. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Great strength being shown here. Long fall and even harder impact. Looks like they want to take things outside. No telling what they have in store now. No count out, so time is not against them. From the top. Good Lord, taking flight. Trying to do as much damage as humanly possible. But at what cost? Ah, what a smash! That is just insulting. Danger here now. You don't want to be near the ambulance looking like this. Trying to close the first of two. Forcing their way out of the ambulance. Got the leg. And dropping the elbow right on the knee. Look at that insult to injury with that one. Now we know what the five fingers say to the face. to unleash the clothesline. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker connects. Okay. Oh. The ambulance awaits. Just have to capitalize on this opening. The position you want to be in right now. And lost into the back of the ambulance. That's not where this superstar wants to be right now. Look at the struggle just to shut that first door. Oh, what a powerhouse collision here. Surviving the shutting door and escaping the ambulance. And the match continues. Oh, 
He's on his heels a bit now. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Slips out of the way. Boom. Dropped on the crown. Look at this. Just unloading. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. And he gets tossed back into the mat. Interesting choice to close the ambulance doors. Must be a defensive strategy. The Viper taking a moment to soak it all in now. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Taking a look inside the ambulance. Now has to think of a way to get their opponent into it. Oh, no, that's a lot of blood now coming from Orton's head. Just mounted with punches and not... And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Elbow will break that up. Viper in full control. Launches. Trying to make his way atop the ambulance. A dangerous position to be in. He's gotten on top of this ambulance. What now? No! Ah! Oh, I just completely off target there. That terrible landing might have just secured them a spot in the ambulance. Scaled the ambulance, and now what does he have in mind? Cody's taking a moment to soak it all in. Where is he going? I can't imagine what he's thinking about. Perched on top of the ambulance now. He's got something big in mind. Destroy your face. I can't imagine that felt good at all. The way things are going, I think we're going to need another ambulance out here. Oh, I've caught him. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Pedigree. Only so much space to work with up there. One wrong move could have a disastrous ending. Orton always has an answer, a plan. He needs to find that right now. Rose looking to end this. Nails the crossroads. He has to put him in the back of the ambulance now. This is the perfect time. These men have shown no indication of staying down. Their guts, their fire won't allow them to give up. on the spot. A single leg camel clutch oh, and a great no. counter. What a punch. This has gone from bad to worse. Someone's got to get out. This is what I was afraid of. No way. Look out below. Putting it all on the line. Using everything to your advantage. Even your own body. Setting up for something here. Launched into the ambulance. Doing their best just to shut that first door. One more door to end this carnage. If they can slam this door shut, it's over. I can't believe it's so close. Almost there. Almost there. And they're not ready to let this end just yet.
Still more fight to be had. The American Nightmare. Showing his power, Alabama Slam. And that holds Cody back. Down to Bonus. And a double axe handle smash. Double axe handle smash. Ah, oh, this is a way to incapacitate every inch of your opponent slowly, methodically, and painfully. With the stop. After that move, Orton can see the victory in his mind. I don't think you can ever know what's really in Orton's mind, Saxton. This is when you have to make your move, when you have to dig deep and carry your opponent into the ambulance. Absolutely comatose after that. Lucky for him, there's a ride to a medical facility waiting ringside. Look at this, just unloading. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. He skirts around it. Getting sucked. And Orton now chaining some offense together. Yeah, Cody has to plot a way to get back into this. He is doing whatever possible to torture the knee. Oof. Oh, Cody anticipated that. And now here come the punches. <laughs> Rose has his opponent hooked. Oh, Medical attention might be needed after that move, and luckily there's an ambulance nearby. He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. Bringing a steel chair into play here. Ah. 
saw it coming and got out of there. Ooh -hoo. The WWE Universe standing at attention, completely entranced by this matchup now. Can't miss action taking place in front of them. Nobody wants to blink. They do not want to miss a second of the action at this point. Taken apart and might be getting a look of their ultimate fate right Figure four leg lock applied. Figure four! Figure four is in! And watch this. Letting him free? Had him where he wanted him, but maybe he has something better planned. being dragged and mangled all the way to the back doors of the ambulance. <laughs> Desperately trying to... First door shut, needs one more. Oh, I'm trying to... Miraculous. Whip back into the ring. Boom! Tossing the shovel right at them. Horton going to that place could be academic from here. Okay, that has to be enough. Has to be able to end this now. Nothing but dead weight and two doors stand between him and victory. And this one might be headed ringside. A defensive elbow to the gut ends that. Cody hooking him up. Oh, 
Randy Orton gets him back. Oh, man, what a strike. Intercepts that attack with a knee right to the stomach. Rose tied that one. Showing some extra scouting, knowing how to answer a counter with a... The American Nightmare. There's Crossroads. That's it. That's got to do it. The engine's running, and the ambulance is ready to go. seen a competitor crumbling before our very eyes. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. And it is getting downright nastier and nastier with each of these attacks. Front face lock. All the way up for a suplex. No, 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 no. Wiggles free. Escapes and a chop block takes him down. <laughs> Devastating counter. Scouting paid off with a DDT. <laughs> Hits him with the counter. Can Orton withstand this attack? Yeah, Cody Rhodes is clearly in control. The pillars of this building must be crumbling from the energy these fans are putting out right now. These superstars are giving it their all, and this audience is giving it right back. Ambulance is open for business. Are we close to hearing the sirens? And he denies Cody. Randy showing he's not out of it. Orton hoping to start a rush of his own now. Counters that. The American Nightmare. Looking to put his opponent on Dream Street. Crossroads. And now is the time. Now is his moment. He's got to get him into the ambulance fast if he wants to end this thing. And now getting posted up in front of the ambulance doors, just motionless here. Oh, Rhodes has become relentless. Orton needs to return to his instincts. Doing their best just to shut the has to make sure they get the other door locked. Pushing with every fiber of their being to slam the door. And this match is over! What a fight! Here is your winner! The American Nightmare! Cody!
The following contest is a special guest referee match and is for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. All right, now here's a man we can trust as a referee. I think you'll do us all proud. Please welcome the special guest referee for this match, Man. Guys, I always thought I would make a great referee. Way better than this clown. Maybe it's time for a career change. <laughs> you? Wearing zebra stripes? Enforcing the rules? Yeah, right. Yeah, forgive me, Corey, but I'm not sure you pass even your first refereeing exam. There's exams? Plural? Never mind. I'm out. He's got a chance here to impress all of us with his ability to maintain order in the ring. A little disorder never hurt anybody. I just hope he doesn't take the job too seriously. The WWE Universe just exploded. The American Nightmare Cody Rhodes looks as ready as ever for action tonight. The Rhodes name means he was born with this business in his blood. He's finally been able to tap into that, and we are now witnessing his full capabilities. Indeed, Corey, the American Nightmare has become a reality. From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins. And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do, and that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. WWE Universe God Mode has just been engaged. We are truly experiencing greatness on a different level.
WrestleMania acknowledge him. Plenty of WrestleMania history for the Tribal Chief, defeating legends like Triple H and The Undertaker. But since taking his spot at the head of the table, he has successfully defended the same championship at three consecutive WrestleManias, defeating the likes of Brock Lesnar and Cody Rhodes. I do not envy the task at hand for this superstar. You are facing a man with all the momentum in the world in Cody Rhodes. Introducing the challenger from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes! And his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion Roman Reigns! Feel the atmosphere. Everyone's on pins and needles. The WWE Universe knows just how much this title means. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. The undisputed WWE Universal Championship is on. Going for a pen for the championship. And the referee stops the count before two. That was not a standard count, and we all know it. Yeah, I know counting to three can be hard, but maybe someone should remind our official that it's part of the job. Oh, no. Getting in position. What's he planning to do here? It's a single leg camel clutch and a great Oh, what a 
kick right to the gut. Just using their foot as a weapon. So ruthless. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Kick to the gut. Boom! DDT. And what should Cody Rhodes' plan be for this matchup tonight? Fight, fight, fight. The heart of Cody Rhodes is absolutely legendary at this point, and he should lean on that, especially if he finds himself in a tight spot. As the old saying goes, the will is greater than the skill. Dropping bombs, trying to escape, and they do. Man, this is about as close as you can cut it. They're playing with fire here. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. And returning to the rank. And Cody Rhodes picks up the W. Here is your winner, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. And with the ref's count, this match has ended. When a match is decided by countout, it leaves you wondering where this match could have gone. The American Nightmare is here. The son of a son of a plumber looking to continue the Rhodes legacy.
Cody Rose has been on a mission as of late to solidify his position at the top of the WWE. He reached the main event of WrestleMania. He conquered Brock Lesnar. Now it's time to finally finish the story. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds. The From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins. And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do. And that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. And his opponent, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. WrestleMania, acknowledge him. Plenty of WrestleMania history for the Tribal Chief, defeating legends like Triple H and The Undertaker. But since taking his spot at the head of the table, he has successfully defended the same championship at three consecutive WrestleManias, defeating the likes of Brock Lesnar and Cody Rhodes.
You can love him or you can hate him, but you must acknowledge him. A certified GOAT. Reigns is now an unstoppable force. Cody Rhodes has said that beating Roman Reigns is crucial to his story, pivotal to accomplishing his dream. Well, Cody could not have picked a bigger target, and Roman does not take kindly to being targeted. He sees Cody as just another annoyance to be swatted away. Roman Reigns is at the absolute top of his game, so why shouldn't he think that? Cody decided to pick a fight with the biggest dog in the yard. Now they're here to settle this once and for all. Worked a big punch. Torturous focus on the leg. In the corner. Being hobbled like that, something to keep an eye on. Reigns had that scouted. Over the top rope. Oh, this is vicious. That's unnecessary. That was showing great awareness of positioning, placing yourself between the ref and your opponent. Uh oh! Had an answer for the big dog. His shoulders are down. And he manages to kick out at one. He clearly has no intention of staying down. <laughs> Chop block turns the tide on their offense. To the nose. And I think something both Cody and Roman have to be careful of here is overconfidence. Cody is so eager to take Roman down, he could get ahead of himself and make mistakes. Roman, meanwhile, thinks his victory is assured and might not take Cody seriously enough. Fair point, Corey. It's going to take a lot of focus and discipline for either of these men to get the upper hand. He'll take things into the ring. Front face lock applied, up and down with a gourd buster. The natural down cover. Stops the count before it too. Doesn't bow well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. Ooh. Oh man, he has fired up now. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Got to find a way to get out of this. Oh, my goodness. Face first into the barricade. He is delivering elbow after elbow. He deflects it right back.
What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. Dropping the elbow. And that's enough to shake anybody's belief in themselves, even Cody Rhodes. What a decisive victory for Roman Reigns. Just incredible. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns! In some ways, it seems inevitable. Another win for Roman Reigns. Cody fought his heart out, but Roman asserted his dominance once again. Cody brings the best out of Roman, but in the end, this was a message that no one, not even Cody, can step to Roman Reigns. Once again, Roman Reigns and Cody Rhodes have found themselves on a collision course. Their stories seem destined to be intertwined. Two men that represent two very proud and legendary wrestling families, both dead set on being the top star, not only in WWE, but in this entire industry. And the only way to truly accomplish that goal is by going through one another. Cody and Roman both know there's a lot riding on this match. They both want this win so badly. That hit connects to Roman Reigns. Oh, that is going to leave a mark. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. And Rhodes able to reverse that. Stomping down. Oh. In the bow. To the outside. This could get wild. Cody's powerless here. And here we go now. Elbow dropped to the knee. Cody's heart being put to a test now. Yeah, Reigns brought the fight in a major way on that exchange. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Any advice for Cody Rose as he takes on the very formidable Roman Reigns? Cody's gonna have to use everything he knows. Every attack, every strategy. Against Roman Reigns, your one best shot just isn't good enough. But I think Cody knows that, and he came here tonight ready to give Roman all he's got. Referee's count only getting higher. Come on, got to get back in the ring. Roman Reigns saying this is not the WWE Universe. This is Roman's universe. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns. The ref completed his count, and we have a winner. It would have been great to see a pinfall or submission win here. Quite a shame it ended by countout. With Cody Rhodes, there's a resilience there that you just don't always see these days. A fortitude that keeps him going, even if it's not always in his best interest. Cody will always keep fighting no matter what. The problem is, sometimes he'll keep fighting even when his body doesn't want to. An admirable quality to have, but also a dangerous one. The Rhodes will always say he fights more with his heart than his mind. And Roman Reigns always 
enters the ring prepared for a fight. Prepared to get oh so physical. That smash mouth, hard hitting style, Reigns has perfected it. And there's nothing pretty about perfection, Saxton. That's for sure. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Just into the face. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Just cranking the head. Delivering nasty stumps. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. <laughs> Hammering down on the knee. He's looking a little off balance. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. to stomp in every single part of his body. Putting the boots to an opponent will take the fight out of them in a hurry. Textbook jumping clothesline. Oof. Uh-oh. Elbow drop. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. From way up. Whoa, what a landing. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring. There is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Any advice for Cody Rhodes as he takes on the very formidable Roman Reigns? Cody's going to have to use everything he knows. Every attack, every strategy. Against Roman Reigns, your one best shot just isn't good enough. But I think Cody knows that, and he came here tonight ready to give Roman all he's got. He returns to the ring. And Rhodes wants more from his opponent. <sighs> My goodness, is this even legal? I don't think so. Now look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Reigns is wasting no motion. Overwhelming attack. Cover. Shoulders are down. And a shoulder in the air. Getting the shoulder up before two tells me the end is not near. Great counter. Impressive ring IQ on display there. Ah, uh, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. So much torque on the knee and ankle. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Strikes with a kick. He's reeling, slowly getting up. That is reckless abandon being shown. And paying off as well. What is in store here? Uh-oh. Inverted suplex. He's heading back to the ring.
looking for the victory. There's two and a kick out. No one saw that coming. Holy moly, Reigns' is toughness on display with that kick out. You got to wonder what more Cody has to do to put him away here. And Cody Rhodes reverses. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Oh, look at the knees. Just unloading knees to the body. of time he's outside the ring now hope he's got a plan for the final cut he's feeling the effects of that last hit Jody building his attack brick by brick in the late stages of the match. What a counter.
An exceptional showing so far for both Reigns and Rhodes. This is what an instant classic looks like. Here we go. It's popping up. The fight is on, and it's furious. Feels like a hockey fight's just broken up. Oh! Two fighters putting their haymakers on auto. No more holding back. Going all out now. The willpower, the sheer guts of these two. Both absolutely dread. Oh, getting the better of that exchange. Someone called a dentist. of showing from Cody tonight. Roman was just as hellacious an opponent as you would expect, but Cody finally managed to put him away. But is this really the end of the story or just the end of a single chapter? You have to think Roman will come looking for revenge sooner or later. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match and is for the World Heavyweight Championship. The Scottish Warrior has arrived. A multi-time world champion and a Royal Rumble winner. 
And to this day, one of the toughest fighters in WWE. The Scottish warrior on the battlefield at the showcase of the Immortals. Who could forget that incredible moment for Drew McIntyre when he won the WWE Championship in the main event of WrestleMania 36. Something tells me the countdown to Claymore has already begun. The Scottish warrior prepared for battle. Symphony can only mean one thing. It is time for Seth freaking Rollins. Listen to the WWE Universe. They're singing along and they're not done yet. Crowd is singing louder than ever on the grandest stage of them all. Seth Rollins at WrestleMania is a whole mood. Yeah, at WrestleMania, Seth Rollins has crushed internet sensations and crushed uh, energy drink bottles. Don't forget about facing his WrestleMania nightmare in the form of Cody Rhodes. Nobody does mania like Rollins. Only the biggest names, the toughest opponents can share the ring with Rollins at Mania. Introducing the challenger from Ayr, Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, the Scottish warrior, Drew McIntyre. And his opponent from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, the world heavyweight champion, Just look at all the gold on the World Heavyweight title. A glorious looking championship. The envy of all men who don't possess it. We know the stakes. World Heavyweight Championship will go around the waist of tonight's winner. The energy in the arena is palpable. Goosebumps are tingling throughout my body, Michael. We know our combatants must have butterflies in their stomachs. Well, nerves need to steady, as these competitors need to bring their A game if they hope to leave with the World Heavyweight title. The energy in this building is palpable, and they just tossed them aside. Just discarded the champ like a chump. Just disrespectful. Just shows you how little the challenger thinks of the champion. And he's taking this to the outside now. He's got a ladder now. He could be contemplating something very risky. Heads out and he has all the time he wants. Point of the elbow finds the mark. Counters on counters, technical prowess on display. Sky high! Way up there. 
Just mounted with punches and not. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Hoist it up. Gun Buster! The champ getting put to the test here. Yeah, as McIntyre was putting that warrior spirit into effect with that. To a lawn dart. And we might be about to go from commentators to participants in this one, fellas. We've seen the length superstars are willing to go to in an extreme rules match to earn the victory. What do you have to do to get yourself in that mindset? Well, it's all about adapting in extreme rules. You really have to be creative and maybe even a little crazy if you want to succeed. into the ring. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Oh. Just a ferocious assault from Matt. Blast off. Diving hammer strike. Four, two. Staying in this one. Now oh, hooking him up. Face first. Driven down. Repositioning their opponent. Looks like a neck breaker. position to be in right now. Oh, right to the throat. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. What's he open to find down there? And now with him going for the table, we're just in straight up appetite for destruction territory here. Taking this to the floor. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. It wasn't the height or distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. Nasty. They weren't that good looking anyway. Oh. Insulting. Disgusting behavior. There was no respect shown there. Yeah. Thrown back in under the ropes. The challenger's looking shaken. Yeah, and there was no questioning Seth's motives after that move. And he's able to reverse. Placed into the corner. 
Oh, goodness! I wasn't expecting a kick to the face. Taking this outside. This could be good. Oh, what a tackle. Covered by the challenger. And it's a kick out at one for the defending champion. He is certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Now that's using your head. Escape just in time. Oh, Seth Rollins. Pedigree. Pure skill on display from Seth Rollins. Yeah, I believe my own hype too, if I could do that. Champ's got the pin to retain. No, a kick out from Drew McIntyre. Not yet. Pulls the ripcord. Knee strike to the face. The challenger not looking good right now. Well, you don't sign up for an extreme rules match without knowing the consequences, Cole. Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Turn your lights out. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clip the champion into the cover. Whoa. Title Whoa. match stays alive. What do you have to do to put this guy away? Here it comes. the title he came out here and defended what was his you have to give him credit
The WWE Universe just exploded. The American Nightmare Cody Rhodes looks as ready as ever for action tonight. The Rhodes name means he was born with this business in his blood. He's finally been able to tap into that, and we are now witnessing his full capabilities. Indeed, Corey, the American Nightmare has become a reality. The following contest is a tag team match set for one final. Introducing first from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic against Seth Rollins. And then one year later, did something his father was never able to do, and that's compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. seen a share of misfortune at Wrestlemania courtesy of Cody Rhodes yeah but tonight the visionary turns that Wrestlemania luck around Saxton. Excuse me. A third generation superstar who honors his family starting all the way at the top with the high chief, Peter Maivia. Without a doubt, furthering his family's legacy in sports entertainment and cementing his own spot on the WWE Mount Rushmore. His greatness transcends eras in WWE history. Powered up in the Iron Paradise, Team Bring It is a lifestyle.
WWE Universe God Mode has just been engaged. We are truly experiencing greatness on a different level. Representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns! WrestleMania, acknowledge him! Plenty of WrestleMania history for the Tribal Chief, defeating legends like Triple H and The Undertaker. But since taking his spot at the head of the table, he has successfully defended the same championship at three consecutive WrestleManias, defeating the likes of Brock Lesnar and Cody Rhodes. can't help but be in awe of the Tribal Chief. I agree, Saxton. This man has truly earned his spot at the head of the table. These teams are ready to test each other in this tag team matchup. We are set for action and starting things off with Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. And this is sure to be a barn burner of a tag match in this encounter with The Rock and Roman Reigns. These teams have built up lots of animosity towards each other and now they have finally reached a tipping point. I would expect Bedlam to break loose here. Oh, 
sharp knee. Roman Reigns gets the tag. Oh, look at this. Headbutt! Uh-oh. Just like that, Roman gets stopped. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoyed every minute of it. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Elbow drop after elbow drop, torturing and punishing the opponent. Over and over, just going all out with every blow. Tagged in. Single leg drop kick caught him. Quickly to cover. And easily kicks out of the count. A little over eager with that cover. He gets tagged in.
teams are in their respective corners for this tag match. We are set for action and starting things off with Cody Rhodes and Seth Rollins. Then the opposing team is the... Sleeper hold cinched in deep. And out of the sleeper. to have been kept down there. Bam! Down he goes. Uh-oh. This isn't going to be pretty. Grinded him down a little. Yeah, as Cody clearly came into this fight with something to prove. Just look at him now. Close line. Has it hooked in? Suplex. Big time clothesline. Good grief. Had that move from the rock scouted. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. He switches it back around. Oh, what a close line. Tagged into action. Samoan drop. And will this be it? Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? He's not even close to being done yet. Oh no, trapping the arm. Vicious stomps to the hand. Delivering nasty stomps. 
You can feel the resentment building with each stomp there. of counter. Looking wobbly in the corner. Roman Reigns just battering his opponent in the corner. This is ugly. He's in off the tag. Able to get there in time. Nicely done. Mm -hmm. Well scouted by the great one. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. Look at this! Barrel roll, Tope! Just a devil-may-care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. And now The Rock finding himself on the receiving end of some more effective damage. Yeah, this is exactly why constant, frequent tags are so important in a match like this, to keep fresh. Counter by The Rock. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. What a hot shot. It's all the way to the outside. Step through. Sharpshooter applied. No, he lets him out. Yeah, I think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there. We've seen this before. The Rock setting up. Here it comes. Yes, Rock bottom. Picture perfect from The Rock. And he stops the count for his partner. Firing off rapid kicks. Just rapid fire kicks. And this is good. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Yeah. Oh, saw it coming and got an elbow for their trouble. Rollins with a schoolboy takedown. Super kick after the schoolboy. My goodness. There's a tag. And tag. He's in now. Finally. Oh, man. He is more than fired up right now. Being carried around with ease.
Reigns. Reigns with the guillotine. Now Cody Rhodes trying to... There's the save. How close was that? Yeah, Cody definitely did the work on that one. Monkey flip! Delivers the knee! Attacks from the arsenal of Cody Rhodes. Yeah, Roman is reeling as Cody chains together offense. Seth Rollins is tagged in! Everything's about to change. to throw him off his game. Planning on what to do next. Oh, sent flying. He's got him scouted. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. And Zagiri finds his mark. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Oh, I came right in the face. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, right in the face. My God. He is delivering elbow after elbow. appreciate his very presence. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. Yes, tag! Held in a perilous position. Getting pushed. 
jumped out of the defensive. Yeah, they've stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. This capacity crowd is really willing these competitors on. It's moments like this that show you what you're made of. Big 
risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. Cody Rhodes hooking up his opponent for the final cut. Boom! To the back of the neck. Cody Rhodes. Ooh, front thrust. Ooh. Rhodes hooking his opponent, and the final cut, perfectly executed. Decision there, Michael. Oh. Yes. Up. Oh. oh, God, that hurt. Oh, boy. German suplex released. And you can tell these attacks are disorienting him. Sustained attacks up in that area could cause impaired vision. The Rock with some good timing here. The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. It's not the prettiest, most honorable, or even the most fun way to win, but hey, countouts happen.